What's up guys, this is the second episode of my Road to Glory and I've just bought the DeMarcos 88 pace uh, centre mid and I think he's going to add quite a bit to the team, quite low on fitness but I don't think I spotted it now uh, and I'm going to go into my, f my second game but first game of this episode and I only got 62 chemistry but hopefully that should improve Real Madrid kits, I'm thinking this guy could have a decent team but Division 5 you always expect the worst he finally clicks play and yeah 100 chemistry, full goal team, full English team. I'm thinking, well, I've got fucking no chance here. But despite that, I do open the scoring. Um, I find Ruben Castro. He uh, takes shots and quick feet, cuts inside, and a lovely little finish. And yeah, I just think he's a great, he's a great player. It shows off that despite being big and powerful, he has also got the movement and the. Uh, the uh, quick feet to really be a top striker in this game. Show the half time stats, they're pretty even. But uh, unfortunately, uh, this guy does break, and as you can see here with Andy Carroll, he plays a three ball that somehow my defender doesn't get onto the end of, and he just walks past everyone with Nathan Dyer and crosses it in, and it's Lampard at the back post. Um, so, annoying goal to concede because I know that my defenders are never going to, bronze defenders are just never going to catch Nathan Dyer. But yeah, that's how it is. I, I, uh, I, I tackle him here and I, I break quickly. I think I'm going to try and do a lot more on the break on this on, with this team because it seems to be working well. And I do tramp it across to Parkinson because it was a bronze player and a one on one. And it was against Joe Hart, so you can't really. really give me any stick for that I hope but he does hit a ball over the top and obviously a ridiculous amount of pace on Nathan Dyer against my bronze keeper and my shit defence again no real chance there it's goals like that but at this stage just pissed me off because until I get some decent defenders which I think I might have to do uh, yeah it's going to cost me but the, the game just finished 2-2 get my first point on the board not the start I would have hoped for but I have had two tough teams um, I think now is when I decide that I'm going to go, I have 919 coins, I, th I feel it's enough for another player, but I do just fast forward my search parameters here because no one really wants to see this. Uh, I'm looking at left forwards and I'm thinking Minyayin looks like a really strong player um, with his 4 star skill at 86 pace. I think Taylor looks good but I do want that 4 star skill that Taylor doesn't offer. Um, and so I just decided to have a look at Barcelona and see if I can get a Pedro. And I, I do manage to find one for quite for, well, quite cheap. It's only, uh, I think it was 850 coins, which for an 84 rated left left wing with decent base, good dribbling, average shot, just good all round stats. At this stage is really what, I, what I'm looking for. And hopefully he's going to be a really good player in, in, the, in the future games I play with him. Um, so I put, I put them inside, I fast forwarded this as well because it's all a bit boring. Try to get a bit more chemistry, swap a few pairs around. I had to take DeMarcus, DeMarcus off because I noticed his fitness was very, very poor. Which is uh, quite unfortunate because it uh, brought down uh, Pedro's chemistry. But I go back into the Division 5 game. And this is where I slide down to normal speed. Uh, and I'm, try I'm trying to find it. It's taking a while for some reason. I'm not, well, I suppose no one's in Division 5 anymore, which is unfortunate. Um, but let me know what you guys are thinking of this series and if you actually enjoy it and if you want me to do a bit of trading. I've got a bit coming up in at the start of the next episode. I do trade a bit to my next player. Who's, it's not an expensive player, obviously, but I had like no, 500 coins less. I traded, made about 500 coins profit and bought a new player so you'll see that in the next episode so if you want to see a bit more of that a bit more trading I can do it on the web app and record my screen or on the console I then go to a game now and it is a absolutely shocking team 41 chemistry uh, um, the only thing that is annoying he did have a goalkeeper which obviously always always helps your cause but um, once again I am the one to open the scoring a uh, bit, bit scrappy but Ruben Castro plays in Pe uh, Pedro Nice four star week for left left footer finish past the goalkeeper. Two minutes in, I'm thinking, yeah, good, good start, this could go well. And you'll see, well, you'll see how it turns out. But I'm, I'm not sure why I took that on his left foot and he's right footed. But another kind of counter attack, my centre back had it, and 
straight through to Pedro. Ambitious shot. <laughs> Cannons off the bar. Brilliant attempt. But comes back out. Pedro heads it through to Ruben Castro and an easy, easy finish. I mean, that's what Castro will give you. He'll be there at the right time and he, he's not going to miss that. He, he, Ruben Castro, the team of the season, will never, never miss that. Um, I make it three goals here with a very nice passing move, actually. And it comes to Darby. Darby. I don't know why I always associate that well with an American accent, but I do. And uh, he, he, he goes through to score, which I, he did very well to do so. One touch and a great thing for his right foot past the goalkeeper. Um, a pretty lucky bounce there as Pedro got tackled within the path of my player. I played it back inside to Pedro. Lovely dummy shot. And no defenders near him. Just powers it straight into the top corner. And that was an absolute brilliant goal. And pretty much rounded off this, this game. I, I did miss out one of the goals he scored because it was pretty shit. But again, this one, like... Pretty, pretty shit goal. Well, I was pretty pissed when I conceded that, but normally it just takes away some coins, really. Um, yeah, so that was a bit of a damper. We've got a few more coins in this game, but it just finished like that at 4 2. And that's where I'm going to leave the video. So if you did enjoy, please comment, uh, like, and subscribe. I did get the achievement for winning a season match fight finally after three games. But yeah. I do hope you guys enjoyed uh, on four points. Hopefully we can get that promotion. And yeah, I've been Harry Free and I will see you all hopefully next time. Thank you.